Yo, 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 what's up, everybody? How's everybody doing? Guys, if you haven't already, make sure to subscribe to the channel. If you're new in here, what's going on? My name is NFL Boy Brandon. We do everything NFL-wise on here. We are getting ready to cover a pretty interesting topic today. As you guys can tell by the title, it says, uh, Aaron Rodgers, is he 100% healthy? And the reason why I bring this up to you guys, well, let me share my screen and show you why. All right. Anyways, guys, sorry about that. <clears throat> so the reason why I bring this topic up to you guys, I don't know if you guys can see that or not. <clears throat> I'm hoping you can. But Aaron Rodgers the other day at OTAs for the first time since having Achilles, um, Achilles surgery, last uh, season that put him out for the entire season. He finally took some throws yesterday at OTAs. I was trying to find this video. I screenshotted this from the video, but lost the video somehow and couldn't find it. <clears throat> so basically, I'm going to describe to you what happened in the whole video. If you guys want, you could go look up on YouTube and uh, try to find the video for yourself. Um, but yeah, the, the in the whole video, basically what happened is, is Aaron Rodgers is seen sitting down on this trailer looking thing. He looks at his at Achilles like he did there. Then an athletic trainer, doctor type person comes over, <clears throat> starts taping up that leg. <clears throat> and then... Uh, and then he goes out and takes a couple of throws. He, like, hands the ball off a couple of times and everything. But in the video, this is why I mainly wanted to find the video for you guys so you could see it for yourself. He was acting very, very gingerly on that leg. Like, you could tell that he did not want to plant that leg fully down into the ground. Like I said, go on to YouTube and look it up for yourself. I tried to find the video. So I can show it to you guys, but all I kept on finding is people reacting to the video and not the video itself. So unfortunately, I couldn't do that. So sorry about that. Now, if I do find the video at some point in time, I'll drop it down in the community tab for you guys to see um, if you don't want to go find it yourself. Um, but yeah, so um, that is going to be very interesting to me coming in because we already know what Zach Wilson looks like, and that's not very good. And you, uh, it being a, you being the Jets organization, um, took a chance in trading for almost a 40 year old quarterback in Aaron Rodgers, and he tore his Achilles last year on a non. Um, a non-contact um, play. And then uh, now to begin OTAs, he's already looking at his Achilles, getting it taped up, um, you know, walking on it very gingerly and stuff. <clears throat> so <clears throat> my only question that I want from you guys is, do you think – that Aaron Rodgers is 100% healthy going into this season because, honestly, I'm not quite sure if he's 100% healthy coming into the season. And that kind of scares me. <clears throat> um, so that, that kind of scares me. Um, I, I, mean, I mean, honestly, um, I'm a Patriots fan. So, uh, honestly... You know, no, I'm just playing. Honestly, I, I don't like to see anybody injured, honestly. Um, and I know how much more the Jets would be a threat with Aaron Rodgers there because I've been saying it. I've been saying it since last season. Um, and I, I said it uh, in the offseason uh, two years ago when they traded for Aaron Rodgers that um, all the Jets needed was a quarterback. They're a quarterback away from making a run at possibly the Super Bowl um, and if Aaron Rodgers is there this season, then I feel like that gives them a good chance at possibly being one of the teams that could make a playoff push, um, especially because this could be Aaron Rodgers' last season. So, yeah, that that's the whole video that I wanted to make, guys. Um, Aaron Rodgers 
just being very gingerly on that leg. Um, so if I hear anything between now and Friday, it's Sunday right now. So if I hear any way, anything between now and Friday, because that's when we're doing our podcast and that is on Friday. In case you guys don't know what's up on Friday, we do a podcast each week called NFL Boy uh, Podcast each and every Friday at 8 p.m. So we will be doing one of those live here. Um, so basically what we're going to be doing on that podcast is we're going to be breaking down the news and we're going to be jumping into the first week of OTA. So I'm going to have video from each camp, um, a little bit of, of video footage of OTAs from each camp. And we will be taking a look at that uh, video while I talk about the teams. Um, but yeah, um, so that that's just what I wanted to talk about uh, was the whole Aaron Rodgers thing. Let me know down in the comments below. A, do you think Aaron Rodgers is 100% healthy if you've seen that video yet? And B, um, this is kind of a um, fantasy question. Where would you take fa- where would you take Aaron Rodgers in fantasy draft this year? Me, I'm not I, I'm not doing anything with Aaron Rodgers wise. Aaron Rodgers isn't even on my watch list. Um, so yeah, I'm not doing anything that has the word Aaron Rodgers written on it because it's not that he's injury prone; it's that he's up there in age. So when your your ability to get injured is a little bit higher as you age, and on top of that, um, an Achilles for a dude that age is a very serious um, injury. So how long is it really going to take for that to fully heal? I don't know. But leave me down in leave me a comment down in the uh, comment section. And let me know where would you take Aaron Rodgers and in fantasy drafts, and do you think he's 100 percent healthy coming into the into this year? I don't think so. But until next video, I'm out of here. Peace. I love you all.